Hi everybody. Today we're going to go over the equipment request form that can be found on MyQC. So what is this all about? Well, at some point you are going to need equipment from me. And I have a burning desire to get you equipment, so therefore we make a perfect match. So to begin, what you're going to do is you're going to open up your browser and we're going to work our way to the Queens College website. And in the upper right hand corner, there's this link that says go to my QC. Now it's important that you have your QC email set up because that's what you're going to use to log on. You're going to click the go to my QC link and you're going to be prompted to log on. Now you would generally type in INSTR slash and then it's your username. So mine would be HWang100, whatever it is. I'm going to use a different login. Then it's your password. And we'll proceed right here. Now we're in the MyQC homepage. And what you're going to do is going to navigate over to Academics. Scroll down and find our department, Family Nutrition and Exercise Sciences. Click on that. And this will lead us to the MyQC Finesse Department homepage. And the first link right over here is the Equipment Request Form. Go ahead and click on that. And you'll notice that it's automatically populated with your information here. Mine is right there. You're going to fill this form out exactly as it's shown in the example. You will fill out the class that you are taking. And then you can go ahead and specify the equipment that you need. So now it's important. So I'll give you an example. I need basketballs. I'm going to need 12 of them. And details, color, size, etc. cetera. Uh, adult sized basketballs. Now you also may need cones. So cones. I'm going to need 15 cones. Large cones. Etc. Now this list goes pretty long. Uh, if you need more equipment than here, just set up another form. But when you're done filling this portion out, you can scroll down and you're going to set up a pickup date. So when do you need to pick up this equipment? Let's say January 15th, 2013 at 10 a.m. When are you going to give it back? January 15th at 12 p.m. Now when you're all said and done, you're going to hit submit. All right, so let's hit submit. Just wait. And you should have this confirmation right over here that says your form has been submitted. Thank you. Your Queens College email, you will also receive a quick little email saying that the workflow has started. That's your confirmation. If you do not see this, your form has been submitted you did not send it in. Okay, so let's go over a few rules to the equipment request form. Okay, so first few things. There's a 48 hour policy, not including weekends or holidays. So example, if you need equipment on Wednesday, the request needs to be put in on Monday. 48 hours, not including weekends. Pretty uh, straightforward, but very important nonetheless. A few other things. Don't ask me for things in person. It's uh, too difficult. There's too many students. So let's just stick with the form right over here. A few other things now. A couple of things not to do. Don't send me text messages requests. Don't call me for requests. Don't email me for requests. I mean, if you're going to be online sending an email, you might as well use the form anyway. Don't write on my wall requesting uh, equipment. And I don't really think people use MySpace anymore, but 
don't use MySpace to make equipment requests. And last but not least, no tweets. You can follow me, but I'm not very interesting on there. A few other rules to take care of now. A couple of things to do. Return all the equipment back to 203A promptly and neatly. We have to share our equipment, so it's good to be courteous to your peers and to me. Keep all the rope I provide you, please. So I will tie things up for you. You know, equipment is very difficult to move around. So just don't discard anything that I give you. Give everything back. Help your peers sort and return equipment. So you'll, you'll find out that equipment is actually pretty heavy and bulky and difficult to move around. So help your peers go and bring the equipment down and up and move it around because it's just much easier that way. Uh, keep the room neat. I can't stress this enough. And you will notice throughout this experience that a neat room is much easier to navigate than uh, a disorganized room. And make appointments to see the closet with me. It's very, uh, it's a good idea to go and have an idea of what equipment we have. You know, there's nothing worse than spending a whole lot of time working on a lesson only to find out that we don't have equipment. So send me an email or, or speak to me and ask me to see our equipment closet so you have an idea what we have available. Last but not least, tell me what a great job I'm doing. I'm looking forward to seeing you all this semester. If you have any questions, you can send me an email.